pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Paul Ryan is a leader who has shown us how to communicate to the American people, and he's also shown us that we need to not only participate in the debate, but we can win the debate on issues like Medicare, issues like poverty, issues that affect the American people. Look, I am just here as a fellow citizen of this country to thank you and to ask you to help us. To help us get our country back on the right track. And the best thing you can do to help us do that is to make Tom Tillis your next United States Senator here in North Carolina. If you really want a representative to represent you in the legislative branch of government, you have to have someone who's willing to raise their hand and do something. You don't need a senator that's been missing in action. You don't need a senator that doesn't show up. You need a senator that's going to speak for you, that's going to act for you, that's going to represent you. The one thing we know about Tom Tillis, he says who he is, tells you what he believes, what he's going to do, and then when he gets elected, he does it. <laughs> so, so in 13 days, we have the opportunity to elect leaders who are committed to you, who are committed to making America great again. And with your help and with your prayers and with your word of mouth and knocking on doors and making phone calls and standing at the polls, encouraging people to join us in making America great again, we're going to do it. I have no doubt in my mind. So I want to thank you all for being here today. It is an honor to share the stage with the, the great congressman from this district and the congressman from Wisconsin. But more than anything, it's an honor to be in the room with people who are committed to making America great.